Are you a mentor? Do you have one? In this next segment, Jay talks about the importance of both. And I'm going to date myself. I was hitchhiking back from Sacramento to Chico State, where I was a business major, as I call the Harvard of the West Coast. And I went through seven interviews in one day, and the branch manager who drove by in a Targa beeped his horn and walked over to me and asked me what I was doing. And the truth is, I couldn't afford. I, 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 I didn't have a car. And this guy's name is Don Lavoy. And they hired me the next day. And over my career, having spent 18 years at Xerox, even though he was my boss's boss's boss, he took an interest in me. I don't know why. And he became a mentor of mine. And over the course of time, as I had gone from Xerox to clarify, to take on bigger levels of responsibility, I would always call him. I didn't have a father. And he really became a sounding board for me because he was so selfless. His interest was me. And candidly, I was selfish. I took from him. That was the relationship. And today, many of the leaders I coach, they don't have mentors. And the truth is, I don't know how anybody can do this alone anymore. 